Good morning, good afternoon. Today, I will talk about this step-in food trailer, made specially to cook and sell churros. The equipment installed is to cook churros, and this food trailer includes a freezer, as there it is this trendy way to prepare churros with ice cream. This, as any food trailer which gets manufactured at Kareem Carts, follows some processes. Plan approval, certification, and final approval by the health department. These processes are essential for a health department permit to be issued. I am standing inside this churros food trailer. This is the front section. This is the service window, where you take and deliver every order. Underneath the service window, an ice bin is installed. This is the place where you put the drinks such as sodas, bottle water, etc. to chill with ice. This is the prep area. The customer is selling flavor-filled churros, for this reason, three flavor injectors are included in the manufacturing process. These churro fillers are essential to add the extra flavor to every churro, such as chocolate, strawberry, or any other flavor. These fillers are NSF certified. Under the prep area, you see there, the bottom storage, and the removable utensils drawer. I'm moving to my right, and here is, the main deep fryer, to cook the churros, being made. It is located next to the churros extruder machine. It is large in capacity. Not only that, but it is conveniently positioned there, so the churros being dispensed from the churros machine, fall straight to the deep fryer to be cooked. The controls for the machine are down here. This is the extruder churros machine. This piece of equipment needs to have a specific space, so it can operate without any hazard. There must be a distance to be considered in installing this machine. For instance, if this machine is installed in a smaller section, the handle will end up on top of the hot plates. Then, the extruder operation will require that the burners to be off. This churros food trailer comes with four hot plates, they measure two feet long in total. There is another dry food storage underneath this section. This is the last section of the front part. We see here a flat foldable table. It might be used as a prep area. It opens, up and down. And it secures itself by pushing it down to lock in. And check this out, here is a 20 quarter commercial mixer for the dough. So, I am going over the equipment and sections. Four open top burners. Churros extruder machine. Deep fryer for churros, and funnel cakes, flavor injectors, and prep area, service window. In front of me is the emergency or safety exit. When opened, I can see the generator and the propane tanks locations. I am turning around and here we find the commercial reach-in refrigerator. It is large in capacity, it is very roomy for the items that need to be refrigerated. Next to the refrigerator, a salad bar is located. This salad bar is very useful for the condiments that need to be at cold temperature. Typically, the operator will put there, extra flavors, chopped fruit, etc.
The bottom section of this salad bar is a refrigerator. Now we see the freezer. This freezer has glass slide door for an easy way to reach the selected items inside. In this case, the operator will have ice cream there to be served along with the churros. Here is a small counter. Now, the sinks. This is the three compartment sink, with drain boards on both sides. This is a requirement by most health departments here in California. And, this is the hand wash sink. Both sinks are NSF certified. On top of the hand wash sink, we have, the first aid kit, soap dispenser, and the towel dispenser. Let us take a look at this rear area. There is a large double shelving on top of the sinks, and the equipment. It is possible, since there is no cooking equipment, that would require an exhaust system. The top shelves are also constructed from stainless steel. So, this is how Churro's step-in food trailer looks inside. As mentioned on another videos, all the cooking equipment must be under the exhaust system, and protected by the fire suppression system when necessary. These are the grease filters. It must be well illuminated. Those are the fire suppression nozzles. Next to the hood, there is a more shelving available as extra space to accommodate the necessary. Right on the corner, the fire suppression components are visible. So, this is the hood, with its grease filters, exhaust motors, and fire suppression system. Well, take a look how the Churro step-in trailer looks inside. This food trailer was approved in Northern California. And it can be approved in many California counties. Los Angeles, Riverside, Orange, Santa Clara, Kern and every county in California. This trailer was approved in the year 2023, and it met all the requirements from the health department. The Churros food trailer is finished in stainless steel and every piece of equipment must be NSF certified. Underneath the sinks, is the access to the plumbing, and storage for the cleaning chemicals only. This is on-off switch for the water heater. Power it on, and wait around 15 minutes to have hot water in the hand wash sink and the three compartment sink. Don't forget, these doors under the sinks give you access to the plumbing only and chemical storage. There is where you put chemical to clean the food trailer, such as bleach, degrease, etc. This is the reason, why you have this small compartment on top of the drain board. This is the compartment for the cleaning hose. The hose is long enough to clean your food trailer inside. On the top area of the inside, the trailer has four LED lights, and two roof vents. The ceiling, and all the walls, are also constructed from stainless steel. The Churro step-in trailer has an anti-slip aluminum floor. It helps to avoid accidents.
If you like this design, we can make one food unit for you. Or, if you have your own design in mind, we can make it as well, as long as it is approved by the health department. Do you want more information? Send us a message via email or text. Or, if you'd prefer, call us at 323-232-6880. Kareem Carts is located at 5850 Avalon Boulevard, Los Angeles, California, 90003. Avalon and Slauson. South Central LA. Come and visit us. You don't need an appointment.